The mass media is often awash with headlines such as 300 migrants fed drowned after attempting to cross the Mediterranean Sea from Libya to Italy, or hundreds of migrants being sent back from Libya, 172 Nigerian migrants repatriated from Libya. The desperation of Nigerians or Africans to jet out of the country for their dream destination countries is on the high side as some of them fall into the hands of swindlers and traffickers. For the past four years, more than 10,000 of men, women, children have died trying to cross this stretch of water and traveling through the deserts, especially to cross from Libya to Italy. Migrants, people, each one of them has a story, a dream, a hope for better life. These migrants are bound for Europe, irrespective of the dangers involved. Some of the victims narrated their ordeals and travails in the foreign lands. Some were abused, violated, organs were said to have been removed and sold. The dreamlands became full of horror for them, but yet some would rather not look back. No problem, I have to take the risk. You, you know, when you want to achieve something, you have to risk. Yes, that's why I prefer to go to Europe. It's God who has the last word. I must make it for my family. To a guardian and counselor at the University of Ibadan, Dr. Taiwa Debukola, it is imperative for Nigerians desperate to leave the country to look inwards. The counseling I want to give to these people is this. There is need for our youth to develop, to understand their potentials, to understand what they can do in the society, what you can do for society. Okay? Each and every one of us is gifted. We are all gifted. There are a lot of things that you can do. Firstly, develop, discover yourself concept. Understand who you are. Know what you can do. Know what you can offer. You see, it is not all the time that you um, you have to you have to depend on government. Many have been killed, maimed, died, abused, lost without hope of return. Doctor Taiwo Adebukola advised that this path should not be tread by anyone. So. It, everything doesn't have to be uh, like you want to travel out, you know, in order to, in order to uh, make your ends meet. The government of South Africa deported 19 Nigerians for allegedly committing immigration-related offences in the country. Just as Libya also sent home another batch of 258 Nigerians, Another 171 stranded Nigerians deported from Libya February 22, 2017. Barely a week after, no fewer than 162 Nigerians were brought back by the federal government. The journey through the deserts, seas and oceans, likewise stories, are dangerous. Do not take these routes. You may never have the second chance. Your life is too precious to be wasted. Shade Sheyeojo, BCOS News.